Good morning, everyone. Well, it's a beautiful morning here in Kensington Metro Park out here in Milford. That we're going to have the Kensington Challenge 15K. This is the 27th running of this event. It's called the John Rigucki Memorial. And uh, this year they uh, are going to give a bunch of proceeds to the Wound Wounded Warrior Project to help our uh, troops from Afghanistan and Iraq. And uh, it's going to be a big crowd out here. The sun's coming out. We're going to have uh, three races, a mile for the kids, a 5K and a 15K. There he comes in. The winner of the 15K right there. Uh, Matt Fact, uh, Warren, Michigan. Uh, it's pretty nice out there for the most part till it started raining at about mile three. You know, but still the, you know, besides the rain, it's uh, pretty pretty nice weather out here. So I'll take it. A little bit hillier than I remember last year being, though. <laughs> okay, here comes our second place. Heard his name is Kyle. Well, here's our second place finisher. Uh, my name is Kyle Mena, and I'm from Ypsilanti, Michigan. And tell us about the race. <laughs> well, I never did it before, so I didn't really know it was going to be this hilly. But the rain kept it nice and cool. A little bit of wind, but that was about it. It was nice and fast. I ran with uh, Matt, the winner, the whole time until the last like mile and a half or so. So it was it was a good day. <laughs> I heard of Eric Green right there. He's our first master too. Then looking strong. He always uh, gives a good performance at Michigan races. Good man. Smiling. Uh, 
race was awesome this year. It's not as hot, it's not humid. Rain was awesome. Really made things a lot easier out there. Yeah, the hills weren't bad, and uh, the people out there were uh, were very supportive. Here's our winner of the Kensington Challenge 15K. Hi, my name is Sarah Vergotti. Um, I'm from Toledo, Ohio. Never been here before, um, but I was looking for a little tune-up race before the Chicago Marathon, so this uh, was the closest one to it, and it was a great course. A little challenging, a little hilly, but uh, other than that, it's it beautiful. So and the weather's perfect. It doesn't seem like it is, but it's pretty perfect for a run today. So, oh, here comes uh, yep, here comes our marathon man, Mr. Doug Curtis. He's looking good as he's finishing up here, and he's the race director of the big turkey trot downtown. Well, keep on coming, Doug. Uh, I mean, it's fine because it cools you off a little bit, so. You know, my wife likes this a lot better than I do. <laughs> Some of us aren't mutters, you know, but but you know what? It's a beautiful course. You know, you see the lakes. You know, I had some fun people to run with. Mary Beth Reader, I had to chase her down, you know, but <laughs> but but it was fun. It was fun. I had a good race. Come on in. And every track club does an awesome job, you know. All the mile markers are there. You can get your splits. You can have fun. Come on, Mary Beth. Come on in. Look at the, the MC over here. Hello. Who am I talking to? <laughs> Michigan oh, Runner Magazine. Hey, oh, I know Michigan Runner. <laughs> we got Just a little, little pity bit. for you. Oh, <laughs> yeah, we're going to song and dance. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, we got Mary Beth Reader, who just finished second and first master. So, uh, we got also, so we'll have her say a few words. Uh, and tell us what you thought about today's race. It was wet. <laughs> It started out what? Yeah, um, it's this is I haven't done this race in a couple of years, so the course has changed. I think it was a little bit harder, but um, yeah, I mean it's it's nice. You you know I think I started out way too fast because there's the uphill, which you know makes you start out nice and easy, and then slam, you know, and I had out of control splits for the next two miles, and then I'm like, uh oh, six miles left to go. <laughs> well, a lighthearted moment here at the at the end of this event here. While well, I'm here with the world famous. American record holder and race director of the Kensington Challenge, Doug Goodhue. Well, Doug, it uh, looked like a successful event, even though some crazy weather from start to finish. Uh, what did what you think about today's event? Uh, you, you know, just as the races started, we saw a little lightning and rain coming in. The sky got dark, but uh, it came through pretty quick, uh, cleared up. And, of course, as uh, you can see now, the sun's out, and it was a very successful event. So, and... Uh, you're going to continue on as a race director again next year? Absolutely, absolutely. I do this in John Rigucki's memory. John was a good friend of mine. I'm here with that passion of wanting to keep this race going. 27th uh, year this year. Next year will be the 28th, and I definitely will be here as race director. Well, awesome. And uh, any last um, comments about uh, today's event? I, I'm just pleased uh, with the turnout. I was very pleased with the Wounded Warrior Project introduction that we had with the national anthem we had a great singer we had a color guard of 10 people out of the american legion out of milford and it was a very moving and i think uh, very successful and of course all of our proceeds this year are going to go to the wounded warrior project and i'm very pleased with that thank you well definitely well thank you for putting on a fantastic race and uh, definitely a michigan favorite the kensington challenge well it's gary morgan signing out michigan runner here at here at Kensington Park here in Milford, Michigan.